Hi everyone, this is Piran Noor Sumro. I'm sending you greetings from Chalmers University, Sweden. I'm a PhD student and involved in runtime and compiler toolchain of Legato project. In this poster video, I'm going to talk about my work on moldable pipelines for CNNs on heterogeneous edge devices. Modern edge devices contain variable core configuration on a single chip, for example, energy efficient cores and high performance cores. An example is NVIDIA's Jetson TX2 and widely used DNN frameworks such as TensorFlow, CAFE, to name a few, do not provide heterogeneity aware implementation of CNNs. However, there are solutions for CNNs on edge devices which support core level heterogeneity through an offline training pass followed by an exhaustive domain search space exploration. We designed a framework for efficient performance of CNNs on heterogeneous edge devices, which are composed of different type of compute resources. A pipeline parallel model is used to speed up CNN throughput for data streaming applications, for example, image classification applications on mobile devices. And to support core level heterogeneity, we use compile time hints to distribute computations packaged into pipeline stages among the cores. And then we perform a brief and guided online training to configure a balanced pipeline. Let's have a quick look and experiments. This figure shows an average time of output generation of four different pipeline configurations compared to the baseline, which is a data parallel implementation of VGG16 and image classification CNN. The lower is better. In the second figure, we show the distribution of computations or the layers into pipeline stages. Balanced is better. Let's look at the worst case. In the worst case, we get a completely imbalanced pipeline, which yields into a delayed execution. It is also reflected into an imbalanced distribution of computations. And in the best case, which is better than baseline, we get an almost balanced pipeline, and it is also reflected into the balanced, computation, uh, balanced distribution of computations. So, in conclusion, I would say that a balanced VGG pipeline increases throughput by 22% compared to the baseline on NVIDIA Jetson TX2. The compile time hints can be used to devise a good seed for such space exploration. In this work, we demonstrate offline partitioning, that is, distributing CNN layers into pipeline stages, and online molding, that is, changing the number of cores for pipeline stages. Thanks for watching this video. I would be happy to answer your questions and get your suggestions. Talk to you in chat window. Bye.